In this tutorial, I will show you how to make a cross section through a terrain. So I'm starting here with uh, terrain, the terrain that was created in tutorial 5. So you can see the uh, contour lines here. Uh, if you look at the terrain tool palette, you'll see we have a on the outputs. There's two. There's the um, wireframe, which is output one, and there's contours, which is output two. Now to start with, I'll just uh, turn back on the wireframe one. Enable that. And then I'm going to go to the layers and disable the free layer. Hide that layer. So you can see now here we have the contour lines and we can also see the the fixed, which is the lines that was created by the surveyor. These are the the road edge lines. So I want to use this for the um, cross section because I'm going to create a cross section along this roadway up onto this top level and then back out onto here. So to start doing this, I'm going to first create another layer. We'll just call it um, section line. Change the color if you want to something. Make it red. And we'll set that to be the default. And then I will draw a polyline along the line that I want the contour the cross section to go. So I'll just start down here. We'll say go to there, there, and so on. And then we'll bring it back down and say over that edge, and you'll see the drop down onto that, and back down to there. Okay, so that will be that's the path that I want the uh, the cross section to go. Start from here, working up through here, over there, and back down here. Okay. So to create that, you go to the drain tool palette, you click. Add new output. You select the section option there. Click OK. The name, you can just let the defaults find. The description, enter. Height amplification. If you want to exaggerate or reduce the height, you can just enter a, a multiple like a 1.5 or 0.5 or value like that but in general leaving at one is is the uh the best so then you just pick polyline we'll select this polyline you say okay now you can see that the uh contour line was created up here going vertical because of the my axis are not I'm not working on the X Y I've rotated so we can either rotate the whole view or we can just rotate this. So there you can see now the uh, the section. It's starting at the bottom here, which is down here. It goes along slowly up this line here across here down, and then it drops off rapidly down along this section here and then levels off slightly and then goes down back to there. Now if you make changes to this, let's say if you uh, instead of bringing it down there, let's say we move it to come down over there, you can see it immediately updates uh, the drawing there so we could bring it like like that, let's say where we go down and then we run along the edge there. See, so you can see what it would look like there. So, yeah, once it's built like that, then you can just modify your section. Okay, thank you.